All right, welcome back in on this Monday morning, getting started, getting back into the routine for many of us here. And one of the things this week we're going to be looking for, especially early this week, is going to be the mild temperatures. Highs today will reach well into the 60s, and that's the way it's going to be for the next couple of days. But it also comes with a chance for some spring showers and downpours. The forecast for today has some of those spring showers returning back to the picture, and I anticipate the highest chance for rainfall today for many will actually end up coming this afternoon. But we've got some rain out there this morning as well. As you can see, using Doppler radar, the most powerful radars that scan the skies over northwest Ohio. We're showing them to you right now. And not only are some downpours being reported like this one just to the west of Ann Arbor, but yes, our lightning detector is up and running for this morning, showing some lightning strikes that are also coming down in some of these heaviest downpours. How about just crossing the Indiana border into northern Williams County there? Uh, that'd be up towards, uh, let's say, Harrison Lake there and over towards Fort Wayne, down towards the uh, airport there on the southeast side of town, a heavier downpour. So Van Wert, Defiance, up towards Bryan, maybe the skies are already very dark are starting to rumble a little bit off to the west. Don't be surprised. There is a thin line of some showers and springtime thunderstorms headed your way. Won't last very long though. Our hour by hour forecast shows by 9 a.m. Pretty much all of this has shifted off to the east. We actually get a pretty good break to develop here. Be a little bit breezy, but it's going to be warm. Again, highs will be into the 60s for today. This is noon. Put the clock into motion by about three, four, five o'clock. Rain's going to become a little bit more likely once again towards this afternoon and evening. This is what I was talking about for the highest chance for rain. Probably down towards Tiffin, Finley, Port Clinton, over towards Norwalk and Upper Sandusky. I think you're more likely in, in line for this second round of rain, but there's still going to be some scattered showers up here towards Toledo on a mild, breezy and soggy evening. Overnight, the rain clears out, sets us up for likely a quiet day Tuesday, but with an east component to the southerly wind, a lake breeze will probably try to squeeze in here, and well, that could keep our lakeshore communities quite a bit cooler for tomorrow. Rain and warm Wednesday, good chance for some showers and thunderstorms there, and then it's back to reality. Highs in the upper 50s Thursday and Friday. There are signs of a cooler stretch of weather moving in also by the time we get towards the Easter weekend.